Hello and welcome to another Market Gauge Trades and Tutorials video. This is Jeff Fish, president of MarketGauge.com, and in this video I want to show you a, a quick and relatively easy way to identify good opportunities to buy the market, individual stocks, near the low of the day. Now, this is especially relevant uh, right now as I make this video because it's the last couple weeks of the year and this particular time of the year has an incredibly bullish bias. Uh, so uh, we do a lot with the opening range at Market Gauge. If you're not familiar with the opening range, uh, this is not a video where we're going to be able to teach you the whole thing, but there's, you know, stick around and uh, you'll be able to pick up a lot of stuff or look at our opening range products. And we also happen to have a... Um, a special going on at the end of the year uh, so keep your eye open for your on your email and you'll see more videos about how to trade with the opening range and do what I'm demonstrating here but let's just get to the the meat of it here in in these five minute charts and I use five minute charts so you can see more uh, information we do have rules that will get even more precise on one minute charts but let's start with the five so you can see more information so I have these lines uh, drawn here at the first 30 minutes and high. So the high of the first 30 minutes is right here, this green line, and the low of the first 30 minutes is the red line. And the idea behind this strategy is to identify situations where the market tests that 30 minute opening range low and then reverses. And when it does that, uh, very frequently, especially in this last part of the year, uh, which is what my uh, other videos talk about, you want to use this as an opportunity for really low risk entry. You can put your stop, make sure you put your stop significantly below the low of the day so you don't just get ticked out with another test of the low. Uh, but just take a look at how this worked out in the last couple of days. You also want to do this in a, in a market that's trending and, and bullish. But so here are the S&Ps ducked under the 30 minute opening range low, reversed back over. Once they do that, they really shouldn't come too much below the low of the day. And um, your initial target, based on what your risk is, could be uh, right up at the high of the day. And this provides either a great day trade that you can take some off near the high and let it run, or a good entry on a swing trade if the, day, if the daily chart is in the right spot. So there's one day then the next day doesn't quite dip below the opening range low but depending on how aggressive you want to be it touches the opening range low consolidates heads back up gives you a good tight stop down below the low of the day again and then yesterday uh, this is an, another great example um, because you're really consolidating, you're clearly consolidating, and not only are you consolidating at the low of the day, but you're consolidating um, near a support level from the prior day. So you got the opening range uh, reversal here, and this is a good example of what can often happen. You get uh, the pop from the opening range low, and then another retest, and then on the second pop, you really want to be focused on it because now you've tested it, and once again, back up to the high of the day where it could be a quick trade take some off if uh, you're looking to establish a swing position now you've you've got it at a great spot since this is probably going to be the low of the day going into the close that means on the next day your trailing stop for your swing can be below the low of the prior day and with any luck as we got uh, today you might even get a gap higher all right so focus on this first 30 minutes of the day look for those opening range reversals especially in um, stocks with bullish ranges and especially right now at the end of the year and if you're interested in learning more about the opening range and the specific patterns uh, don't hesitate to, to contact us at info at marketgauge.com or leave a comment below and uh, maybe we can help you improve the profitability of your trading best wishes in your trading and i'll see you in the next video